Hi and welcome to ClickFix. This video will demonstrate how to license your ClickView desktop using two different methods. For the first one, click Settings, User Preference, go to your License tab, and click Change. Under License Key, paste your License Key information. Organization field is optional. You can click Next and select your region. We'll go ahead and take the default USA, hit OK. If you agree to the end user license, go ahead and hit I agree, and you should see the validation successful. Click continue and OK. Up at the top, you will see that the personal edition has changed to X64. You can close ClickView Desktop and reopen it in order to further validate that the license was enabled. Go to help, document support information. You should see license key information in there as well as when you go to help about ClickView, license key should also be listed there. You can click OK. And now we are going to clear the license information so that we can demonstrate the second scenario where a valid internet connection is not available. So we go ahead and clear that license information. You can see that personal edition goes back at the top and we will simulate a problem with internet connection by just enabling a invalid proxy for internet connections. We'll go ahead and hit connection, LAN settings, and just enable a bogus proxy. Hit OK. And you can close IE. You see that proxy server isn't responding when you try to go out to the internet. Now if I go to settings and user preferences again, and change license, go through the same steps of pasting the license key and control number, then hit next, and I agree. You will see an error message saying that it was unable to contact the ClickView license enabling server. We'll do enter my license information manually and hit continue. This is where you paste your LEF or license enabling information that was provided to you or if you don't have that information, you can retrieve it at the left1.clicktac.com address, paste your license key, and trigger the CAPTCHA, and request left. Copy that information into Click View, and hit Next. You see validation successful. Click Continue, and OK. You see personal edition, but if you close it and reopen, you see X64. You can validate again that the license key is listed. And that's it. We are done. If you would like more information, search for answers using the Unified Search tool on the support portal. It searches across the support knowledge base, click Community, click Help Site, and click YouTube channels. Take advantage of the expertise of peers, product experts, and technical support engineers by asking a question in Click Product Forums on Click Community. And don't forget to subscribe to the Support Update blog. Thanks for watching. Nailed it.